What's going on mga dong o mga jai? This is Mr. L, ang inyong pambansang dudong. Guys, kung bago na kayo sa channel ko, please click like and subscribe at hit yun na rin yung notification bell para updated kayo sa mga new videos ko. If you are a vlogger, YouTuber, or a content creator, it is very important to have our videos a good thumbnail. Here's why. Una, kasi yung thumbnail natin, ito yung first thing na makikita ng mga viewers sa mga uploaded videos natin. So, kung meron kang maganda at attractive na thumbnail, like maganda yung color combination ng yung thumbnail, maganda yung design or yung layout, and maganda yung font na ginamit mo, pwedeng maging factor ito na i-click and eventually panoorin nila ang mga videos natin. And pwede rin ito maging deciding factor ng mga viewers whether to click or not to click our videos. Halimbawa, kung gagamit tayo ng mga catchy lines and statements sa thumbnail natin, matitrigger yung kanilang curiosity which lead them to click and watch our videos. And also, yung thumbnail, nagbibigay siya ng overview sa mga viewers kung ano ba ang nilalaman ng mga videos natin. So, for today's video, I will show you an easy and uncomplicated way to make a YouTube thumbnail using this. So guys, marami namang tools and software na pwedeng gamitin sa paggawa ng thumbnail. Katulad ng Photoshop, which I mainly use sa mga thumbnails ko. Meron ding Corel Draw, meron ding PowerPoint sa mga Microsoft users, meron rin Keynote sa mga Mac users, at meron ding PixArt na ginagamit ng karamihan. Kaya lang, kailangan mo pang i-download at i-install ito. At hindi lahat sa atin merong access para ma-download ang mga to. At hindi rin lahat marunong gumamit nito, lalo na sa Photoshop and Corel Draw. On the other hand, here is Canva. So what is Canva? Canva is a browser-based graphic design tool, which means hindi mo na kailangang i-download ito sa mga devices ninyo. So ang kailangan mo lang ay internet connection, web browser, katulad ng Firefox, Internet Explorer, or Google Chrome. And don't worry guys, kasi you can sign up an account sa Canva for free. And meron din siyang paid version which means makaka-access ka for more features. But I can assure you guys na sa free version pa lang makakagawa na kayo ng magandang thumbnail kasi ang daming mapagpipilian na templates for free. At hindi lang yan guys ang pwede natin gawin sa Canva. Pwede rin tayong gumawa ng book cover layout, business cards, um, invitations, resumes. But for this video, we will focus on making a YouTube thumbnail. So guys, kung ready na kayo, ready na rin ako. Let's do it! Alright guys, so i-open lang natin yung ating browser. And just type the word Canva. So, lalabas na dyan yung Canva. Just click on the link. And, yan na siya. So, guys, makikita nyo dito na pwede tayong mag-sign up by a Facebook account and Google account. But, in my case, meron tayong account. So, kailangan lang natin mag-login. So, yung mga details natin, i-input lang. And, click login. So, this is Canva. So, guys, as I said, makikita nyo dito na merong maraming templates na pupipilian depende sa mga projects ninyo. Merong Facebook posts, logos, mga resume, templates, at marami pang iba, guys. So, but for this video, we will focus on making YouTube thumbnails. So, itype lang natin yung YouTube and lalabas dyan yung merong YouTube channel art and YouTube thumbnail. 
Alright, so since we click the YouTube thumbnail, so makikita natin dito yung iba't ibang free na templates para sa ating YouTube thumbnail. So, all you have to do is mamili kayo kung saan dito yung gusto ninyo. So, guys, mamimili lang din ako para sa gagawin kong sample na YouTube thumbnail. So, scroll, scroll lang. Um, saan ba dito maganda? Um, okay. Okay. Actually, guys, napakarami niya. So, depende na yun sa inyo talaga sa taste niyo or whatever. Which one you like. Scroll lang natin. So, ito yung pinili ko. So, guys, kailangan natin i-delete yung picture. So, just click delete on the keyboard. And, uh, so, nakikita rin natin on the other side, maraming stock photos si Canva na pwede natin gamitin. So, like for example, mamili tayo. So, ito. And all you need to do is, is stretch natin yung picture para mag-fit siya sa frame natin. And napapansin nyo, nawala yung text natin. So, meron dyang um, position. Click, click nyo natin yung position. And meron dyang mga options. But uh, para makita ulit yung text, we will click on the backwards. Yan. So guys, napapansin nyo na parang mali yung yung placement ng text sa picture. So let's click flip and flip horizontally. Yan. So, okay na siya. And then you can also adjust yung picture natin. The brightness, contrast, saturation. So, depende na yun sa inyo guys kung need nyo pang i-edit yung ating picture. So, I don't need this picture. I need my picture. So, kailangan natin i-delete siya. And then, punta tayo sa Uploads. So, makikita nyo dito yung folders sa computer natin. So, i-click lang natin yung picture na gagamitin natin. So, ayan na. So, click and drag lang and then stretch natin yung picture para mag-feature sa ating frame. Alright guys, so, i-set lang natin ng mabuti yung picture natin. Alright, so, it's time to change our text. Click lang natin and let's type here, free and easy. Since free and easy naman talaga yung ating tool. And, dito naman, lagyan natin make, oh sorry, make YouTube thumbnail with Canva. So, it's like, medyo malaki, so, adjust natin yung font. Yan. And then, maliit siya masyado, adjust natin ulit. Okay. So, parang kulang siya ng word, guys. Meron siyang space na malaki. So, adjust mo yan natin. Um, so, lalagyan natin lang your. So, let's change the color of the object. Makikita nyo sa upper left, merong color box. Click lang natin. So, meron mga options dito. Or kung, kung wala naman dyan yung gusto nyo, i-click nyo yung plus sign and meron tayong color slides na pwede natin pagpilian. Or kung hindi naman, pwede nyo i-type yung color na gusto ninyo. So, lalabas yan. Just uh, select what color yung gusto ninyo. So, yan. Mamili tayo. So, makikita nyo sa thumbnail natin nag nag-change yung color nya automatically. So, pwede na tong red color kasi match siya sa damit ko. And now, let's change the color of our text. So, click na lang yung font color and um, change that into red. Yan.
Alright guys, so gusto ko naman magdagdag ng logo ng Canva. So, open natin yung browser. Search natin Canva logo. Yan. So, lalabas yan yan. So guys, marami dito makikita ang Canva logo but just be sure na yung kukunin natin is high resolution and naka PNG siya which means transparent yung background niya. So right click natin and copy image. Then let's go back to Canva. Paste lang natin command V para sa Mac and control V para sa Windows. So adjust lang natin yung logo then uh Lagay natin siya dito sa my shoulder banda. Okay. So, adjust na lang. Yan. So, guys. Uh, gusto ko magdagdag ng YouTube logo dito. Or icon. So, click lang natin yung elements. And makikita natin dito yung mga objects. And mga icons. So, guys, makikita nyo dito sa bawat icon, merong mga sign na crown or dollar sign. So, ibig sabihin, hindi yan free. Yung may crown para lang sa mga premium account, yung may dollar sign is kailangan natin bilhin. So, ito yung YouTube icon or logo. And that is free. So, adjust lang natin. And, lagay ko siya dito. Okay. So, adjust lang natin. Yan. I think okay na siya. So guys, uh, pwede rin tayo mag-change ng background. So click nyo yung background and meron dyang maraming pagpipilian. And there's more na hindi ko masyadong familiar. So I will just um, explore that one. Alright guys, so since okay na yung thumbnail natin, kailangan lang natin siyang i-download. So just click the download sa upper right. And then maraming file type dyan. Meron tayong PNG, merong JPEG, merong PDF. Pero since hindi tinatanggap na YouTube yung PDF, so click natin yung PNG na high quality. Alright? So click natin siya. And download. Yan. So just wait. Preparing your design. Yeah. So that's it guys. Na-download na natin. So, i-check natin yung ating thumbnail dito sa ating downloads. Yan. Alright. So, ganyan lang siya kadali. Ganyan siya ka-easy na gumawa ng thumbnail sa Canva. So, very user-friendly siya and no need to download and install this tool. So guys, that's it for this video and I hope meron kayong nakuhang tips on how to make and improve your thumbnail using Canva. So guys, kung meron kayong questions, suggestions, or gusto nyo magpa-shout out, please comment down below. And kung gusto nyo rin i-share kung ano bang software or application ang ginagamit nyo for making thumbnails, you can freely comment down below. See you on my next vlog.